Hi! Welcome back. My name is Coach Meredith. You can call me Coach M. Um, I am a program manager for Playworks Illinois, and I am here playing with you from Chicago. Um, for those of you who joined me this morning, again, welcome back. I'm so glad you're back to join and uh, jump into another game with me. For those of you who are new, welcome. We had a little warm-up this morning. Don't worry, we're going to jump right back into a game. You're still going to have fun with us. Um, we're going to do that game right now. And then there's going to be another activity, a little cool down and a little cheer in another two hours from now. So you have plenty of time to still play if you missed us this morning. Um, are you ready to play? If you're ready to play, say, we ready. Yeah, we are. I'm super ready to play. Um, a couple things before we get started. One, is there someone there with you? in the house, maybe in a different room, tell them to come join you. Bring them in here. They want to play too. Whether it's an adult or another person your age, tell them to come join us. Bring them in. Are they coming? Did you call them? Cool. They'll catch up. We're going to keep cruising. The other thing, there's a little button on your screen that says share. So I want you to click that button, share it out to everyone else. Everyone deserves to play a little game right now, so we might as well invite everyone and everyone. All right, so go ahead, click that share button, share it out. Maybe they'll join us in a few seconds, too. Now, if you're ready to play, say, we're ready. Fantastic. I'm ready, too. So we're going to play a game. For this game, the first thing I need you all to do is stand on up. So I'm going to come back here so you can see me. And you want to make sure that you have plenty of room to move around. So you should be able to reach up high and not touch anything. You should be able to reach down low. There should be nothing around you, nothing that you might kick or bump into. So you want to stick your arms out and make sure that you're able to go in a full circle without touching anything or anyone. If you're good to go and you have a space, I'm good to go, coach. Great. If you need to move something out of your way, maybe there's a chair next to you, or maybe you have some toys on the ground, go ahead and take five seconds to move that. Five, four, three two, and one. Before we get, play, get playing, we want to make sure that we have a few uh, rules that we, we know before we go. So I want everyone to repeat after me. I will, I will play safe. I will be respectful. I will have fun. All right, you ready to have some fun? We're going to play a game called My DVD Player. What's the name of the game? You got it. So your goal in this game is to try to follow my directions to a T. So you want to make sure that you are listening really, really closely to what I say and make sure that you're following the action that matches that direction. So if you ever watched a movie, um, you usually have a remote in your hand, you're able to pause that movie, you're able to maybe fast forward, maybe you missed a really important part, or maybe your favorite scene in a movie and you want to watch it again, you want to rewind. We're going to be doing all of that, except y'all are the stars of the show. So I have the remote in this game, but you all are the movies that are going to be pausing, you're going to be playing, you're going to be fast forwarding, you're going to be doing all this movement, but we're going to be staying in one spot. If you're with me so far, say, mm, yeah, I'm with you. Great, I'm going to keep going. So I'm, there's going to be, again, a lot of different directions you have to listen really, really closely for. So for example, if I say the word play, that means we're going to play. Our movie's going to roll. So when you hear play, you're going to skip in place. Can you show me skipping in place? You got it. You Maybe you can even march in place. But we're either skipping or marching. So what do we do when we hear the word play? You got it. Why don't you show me which one you're going to do, skip or march? All right, I'm going to skip too. All right, but if you hear the word pause, pause means freeze. So no matter what you're doing, you got to pause right there. We got to take a little snack break. Not really. If we were watching a movie, we might be taking a snack break, but we're going to freeze right where we are. If you hear pause, and maybe you don't freeze right away, that's totally fine. You are going to stay in the game, but I'm going to ask you to remind yourself that you are awesome. So if you make a mistake in this game, you're going to say, I'm awesome, I'm awesome. What are you going to say? Yeah, you're going to tell yourself that two times. I'm awesome, I'm awesome. So again, 
If you make a mistake in this game, show me and tell me what you're going to say and do. I'm awesome. I'm awesome. Yeah, you are. So let's try that again. So can you everyone show me play? Pause. Beautiful. Sometimes, like I said, we want to fast forward through a part when we're watching these movies. So when you hear fast forward, we're going to move really, really quick. We're going to run in place. So instead of skipping, when you hear fast forward, you're going to run in place. So I'll show you. Fast forward looks like this. You're going to get to go moving. You should be able to move those knees really, really, really quick. They don't have to come off the ground that much. But when you hear pause, that means brace. So let's try that one. Everyone show me. If you're ready to try, say, yeah, let's try that. All right. Show me play. Show me fast forward. Oh, I'm shaking my camera. Show me pause. You got it. Everyone say, whew. Did y'all nail that? Yeah, you did. But again, if you made a mistake, maybe you skipped when you heard fast forward. It's an I'm awesome. I'm awesome. You ready for some more? Beautiful. So sometimes, like I said, the favorite scenes, and when I'm thinking about my favorite movie, sometimes I really love when they sing a song, or I really love the scenery in a movie, and I want to go back. I want to see it all again. So I might rewind. What are we going to do? You got it. So when you hear rewind, what you're going to do is walk backwards in a circle. Again, I don't have a lot of space. I can't really walk around my house. You won't be able to see me anymore. So we're going to walk in a circle. This feels really, really weird. Can you try this with me? I don't think I've ever done this. Have you? Plus, you got it. So show me, rewind. Show me, fast forward. Show me, play. Show me, fast forward. Shaking my camera again. And pause. Nice work, looking good. That rewind was kind of wild, huh? Should we try that one more time? I kind of want to try that one more time. Everyone show me rewind. Pause. Gotcha. All right, team, we got a few more. Sometimes it's really, I don't know if you've ever tried this, but when you watch a video in slow motion, it's really funny. Sometimes you see facial expressions get really goofy. So when you hear the word slow-mo, slow motion, you're going to move in slow motion. So I want you to imagine that you're running towards something. I want you to make goofy faces when you do it. Can y'all show me slow motion? Pause. Play. And one more time, let's practice that slow motion. And pause. That one's really silly. All right. Now, sometimes we need to take a real break. A snack break isn't going to cut it. We can't pause it. We need to just power off. We need to stop. What do we need to do? You got it. So we need to stop the movie. We need to turn it off. So when you hear me say power off, what am I going to say? That means we're stopping. But you're going to power off. So you're going to turn yourself into a little ball. And you're going to crouch down. Can you all show me power off? You got it. You're going to crouch down. You're going to get really tiny. We're going to take a little pause. So everyone show me power off. But if it's time to power back up, we stand up. So one more time. Show me power off. Power on. Power off. Power on. Power off. Power up. Play. And pause. All right. Whew. Everyone say, whoo. Are you as warm as I am? I am definitely toasty. I am moving. I'm ready to play a full-on round. All right, so we just had a ton of different directions. So the first direction that we heard was play. So what do we do when we hear play? You're right. We can skip or we can march in place. So everyone show me play. That's one thing you're going to hear. You might hear me say pause. Nice work. Pause just means freeze. What's another direction that we know? Yeah, we have fast forward. Fast forward means run as fast as you can in place. But we're not going to run around the house. Then we're going to run right in place. So can you all show me fast forward? You got it. What's another one that we can do? 
Rewind. Yeah, rewind's that really silly one. I feel super silly when I do this. We're going to do it, make a really tiny circle in that space that we have and walk it backwards. And I've never done that ever. It feels really silly. Totally new skill of mine. Learn something new every day. What's another one that we have? Slow motion. This one's really silly too. You're right. Um, so for slow motion, you're going to move in place as if you're running to save something or save someone. So you're going to make a really big face like when you're slow motion. Got that? Fantastic. We got a couple more. Who can remember what those last two were? These ones are fun too. We get to power off. That means we're going we're gonna to turn off everything and we're just going to go down to the ground. Turn into a little ball. And then, what, what's that last one? Power on. You got it. Stand on up. So we got power on, power off, slow motion. We got rewind. We got fast forward. We have pause and play. If you think you can follow all those directions, give me two thumbs up. Say, I got this, Coach M. I think you do too. I know I got it. I'm super excited to play a full on round and get get moving and get even toastier than I already am. So again, if you make a mistake, maybe I say, um, I say play, but then you end up running in place. That's a good job, nice try. You can keep whoever else is playing with you accountable. So if you see someone make a mistake, I want you to tell them, good job, nice try. What will you tell someone if they make a mistake? You got it, and I'll make sure to tell myself that. My dog's here. He's probably going to tell me that, too. If you make a mistake, you're going to tell yourself, I'm awesome, I'm awesome. But if you see someone else who's playing with you make a mistake, you're going to tell them, good job, nice try. If you're with that, say, I can do that. Awesome. I think, yep, Loki's over here. He says he can do it, too. If you're ready to play full real, say, for real, for real. For real, for real, we're going to play. Are y'all ready? All right, let's stand on up. Shake it out, say, I got this. Put those big listening ears on. Can you show them to me? You got it. And we're gonna kick it off with play. Rewind. Fast forward. Power off. Power on. Power off. Power on. Power off. Power on. Slow motion. Fast forward. Play. Pause. Rewind. Oh, fast forward. Uh, power off. Oh, power on. Uh, power off. Up, uh, power on. Slow motion. Ooh. Rewind. Fast forward. Pause. Play. Fast forward. Pause. Slow motion. And pause. And power off. Oh, all right, team, let's power back on. I want everyone to shake out those hands. Say, whoo. Shake out those hands again. Say, whoo. And one more time, shake out those hands. Shake out just your fingers. Shake out just two fingers. Shake them over towards anyone else who is playing with you. Say, thanks for playing. Tell them, good job, nice try. You got it. And shake it towards the screen for everyone who else was playing with us. Say, thanks for playing. You can put those fingers down. Everyone take a big breath in and let it out. This time we're going to do a dragon breath. So a dragon breath, we're going to take a big breath in, and then we're going to let it out like a dragon does. We're going to go... Let's do that together. Ready? Take a big breath in. Let it out like a dragon. Take one more big breath in. Let it out like a dragon. You got it. 
What was the name of that game? You're right, my DVD player. If you were the star of the show, give yourself a pat on the back. All of you were the stars of the show, so everyone should be patting themselves on the back. Uh, I had so much fun playing this game with you. Um, this is a game that you can play on this video, of course. Who else could you play this game with? Adults at home? Could you go play this in the be in out, out, outside? Yeah, if you're in a warm place, you got some free open space to yourself. Totally. So you can definitely play this with other people. You can teach other people who are um, home with you how to play this game. Strongly encourage it. I had so much fun with you. I'm going to see you all in almost two hours for one last activity and a little bit of cool down and a little bit of a super silly cheer that I love, love, love. I cannot wait to teach you. So to close out our game, I want to appreciate you all with a looking good clap. What kind of clap? You got it. So for this clap, we're all going to count to three together. So we're going to say one, two, three. We're going to clap one time. We're going to draw a mirror in front of ourselves. We're going to tell ourselves, oh yeah, looking good. Can you do that with me? It's super silly, but it's super fun. So let's do that. Let's count to three. One, two, three. Clap. Draw your mirror. Tell yourself, oh yeah, looking good. You are looking super good in this game. I will see you all super soon. 